everyone. My name is Yao Aung Sam, and I'm going to be your instructor today. I have my good friend and student over here, Papa Etienne Kaku. And the idea today is, I know most of you have drums in your houses, and you can play while you are in quarantine. So please, follow these instructions and have fun at home with your friends and family and joy. Today, the rhythm we are going to do is quite simple. This is Palogo, simple patterns you can follow. And by the way, Palogo is a social dance piece, a rec recreational dance piece from Ghana, from the capital city, Accra. But is the, the drum need to be closed or open? Good question. Now you have to pull the drum towards you and tilt your drum away from you. So you can get the sound from the bottom of the drum. If the, the drum is sitting like this, the sound is muted. And then you hold it with your, with your legs and your knees so that they, are, they, are, they stay, they, they do not move around. Perfect question. Okay, ready? Yes. <laughs> So this is a tone, it's a bass, it's a slap. With a slap, your hands, it's kind of in a curved position. And then you put your, all the fingers together. Now every drum has its slap. Jimbis are different. Typical Ghanaian drums, the skin is different, so the hands are curved a little bit more. So the first part we are going to play goes like this. Intro the palogo goes like this. I'll do it first, and my good friend will follow. Nice. Now let's do it together. So together we start and we get into the rhythm. One, two. Second part to Pablo. Okay, so the second part goes like this. Please, can you play slowly? Mm. Very that? Nice. Yes, exactly. Yes. Good. Thank you. Play the last part as an open tone or a slap. So you can if that one goes like this. Good. Now what makes music beautiful is playing two different parts at the same time. So he was going to do the first part, and I will do the second part. Okay, let's go. Together with the intro. Now 
the third part to power logo to make it more interesting. It goes like this. So. and then the lead drum will play on top of it. So let's review from the top to here. And then... With the intro, so the first part, let's slow it down so that the little ones can pick it up. So one, two. simple instruction class. Depends on what hand is stronger. I'm naturally left handed, so I, I use a lot. I'm ambidextrous, but I use my left hand more. Okay. And so a lot of my playing is dictated with my, by my left hand. Okay. If you're right hand, however you can get the rhythm, just watch our hands and use the hand that is, uh, dominates anything that you do. Can I play the, yes. the last one? Yes. For me, we start together, crinketing, crinketing, pass, take it, take it, too. and then I'll add. Uh, so now, drumming can also be equated to cooking. You have a lot of ingredients, but you have to put it together. So we are, we have a nice, beautiful meal. So we start together, and then I'll do the, the other parts to conclude our class. Okay. So we start slowly, and we'll, we'll pick it up. So the first part is. Tone 
Oh, and mute that tone. Okay, good. Two. 